109 x right here i just wanted to show everybody what's left of my bike after crash i had a it was like a i was going down a, a street and there's another street that teed into it and a lady in a minivan pulled out right in front of me i freaking the front of my bike hit her quarter panel i would have hit her driver door but i was able to swerve a little bit the last second hit the quarter panel launched me over her hood about 20 feet uh i was about 20 feet from my bike when i came to i got knocked out on impact i was wearing my helmet and my icon spine protector vest so no major injuries didn't break anything but definitely got some bumps and bruises and scars spent two days in the hospital Missed a couple weeks of work. You know, kind of a bum deal, but the worst part is this bike, man. It's totally trashed. Um, you can see here the uh, one of the foot pegs is broke out of the frame. So I mean, it's totaled. Usually, if there's like a scratch on the frame, they'll freaking total a bike. You know, you could. You, maybe someone who knew what they were doing could TIG weld that, maybe. But, I don't know. Insurance will probably total it. So, but what I gather, because look, like, there's damage on top of the bike. Like, the taillight's broken down. So, all, what I can gather, what I think happened, is when the bike hit, there was so much kinetic energy... And so much, so many forces going on, it, it actually turned over, it flipped over, and landed upside down and then on its side, or maybe hit the tail and then flipped over on its side. That's what I think happened, but here's the, what's left of the front wheel. Oh, there goes my screwdriver. Totally strapped, totally trashed the rotor, totally stripped from the inside. Bearing. Headlights completely obliterated. The headers are smashed, crink crinkled up like freaking a cardboard tube <laughs> against the motor. The motor is probably still good. Radiators smashed. Forks are smashed. Crazy little dents here and there. Brake calipers. Or no, I'm sorry, that's the, for the fucking front fender, sorry. Front fender's obliterated. This rotor is about halfway broke off too and bent. And you can see the forks are tweaked. Gas tank's fucked. The tail light. <laughs> Exhaust fared fairly well. Got, it's got some cracks in it, but I mean, all in all. So, yeah, here's more damage on the radiator. I didn't even see that before. So, you know, anything from the triple tree forward is just fucked. But it's all the coolant leaked out of it, but I didn't see any oil leaking, so I, I think the motor's probably okay. But, I mean, I'll let them total it and take it. There's no way I'm going to freaking take the time to fix this. It's just a shame, man. I really love this bike. I did my bun burner ride on this bike, you know. It had sentimental value. I wasn't ready to get rid of it. I love this bike. But I'm okay, you know. I'm I'm alive, and I'm I'm working on getting another bike right now. So, I just got... Uh, a new, a freaking brand new rear tire, and brand new grips, and brand new spark plugs in this thing. Like, not even a hundred miles. No, I freaking can't even use them. Like, this tire's still good, but they're gonna take it. So, yeah, that's what's left of my poor whip. Man. So once again, oh, here's some more shit over here in this bag.
It's all the body. All the fairings and plastic destroyed. So, you know, wear your helmets. Watch out for these fucking people out here in their cars, man. Luckily, I was only going like 35, but I'm even that I'm super lucky. I only got knocked out and didn't break anything. And it might even be because I got knocked out that I didn't break anything, you know? Nice and limp. But, uh, anyway, that's the deal. So, we'll keep you posted on when I get a new bike and everything. So, be safe out there, guys. Take it easy.